If you like chicken livers, I'm going to show you how to cook these where they're really, really tasty and they take very little time to do. This is a meal that not everyone likes liver. Uh, chicken livers are like super delicious. The one nice thing right now about making chicken livers is they're very inexpensive. They're really great for families or a single person that wants to eat something and doesn't have a whole lot of money. The way the economy is right now, food is very expensive. So chicken livers is a very um, economical meal to make. So what I do sometimes if I don't want to make a, a huge meal, I just want something to eat for a little bit and I can use maybe a portion of this because this is a large one. I'll make some chicken livers and I'll make it in this gravy that I'll show you how I make and I pour it over rice and then you can have a green or you can just, it could be just a quick meal. So um, I'm going to show you how to make this. So first thing you do is you, you rinse all the, the blood out of the chicken livers. Okay, so the first thing we do is we're going to season it with salt and pepper and a little bit of garlic powder um, on both sides. Um, I have about five chicken livers here. It's just going to be myself. So I put the rest of the uh, chicken livers, I put the lid on and put them in the freezer. So that's a one thing good about them is that they keep quite a while. You can freeze whatever you don't use. So this is just going to be a, a, a little meal for myself. And like I could make two or three meals out of that large little tub of uh, chicken livers. It, it's very economical, like I said. This is for people that like chicken livers and don't really want to cook, you know, a big meal or, and they don't want to spend a lot of money. So this is where I start and then I get some flour and I bread all of these in flour just like this. And um, I made this up myself. I mean, I'm sure there's other people that make it, but many years ago, I uh, just experimented and I made these. And one time I made them over mashed potatoes. And so this makes its own kind of bechamel gravy like. So we'll go over to the stove. Okay, so the first thing you do is you heat your skillet with a little bit of olive oil or whatever kind of oil you want. And then you, you add the butter in it, uh, maybe a tablespoon of butter and maybe uh, a tablespoon of oil, whatever kind you want. But this is to prevent the, uh, the butter from burning. Okay, and then after you kind of get your butter in there and it's kind of melting, you add the chicken livers that have been rolled in flour. And you turn up the heat just a little. You're going to uh, cook these on low. Um, I have it like on a three on my, um, my um, gas stove. So right now we're just going to kind of let these simmer for a little bit. You want it like right around three. You can maybe turn it up a little and kind of watch it. Okay, they've been cooking probably five or six minutes. Now we're going to flip them over. and then we'll just kind of um, cook them on this side for probably another five or six minutes on low. Okay, we flipped it over a couple of times. Some people like their chicken livers not real well done um, and some like theirs medium. It just depends. This is kind of a medium well right now um, and I am going to cook it a little longer because I like mine kind of well, pretty well, not super well. Okay, the last step is once your chicken livers are cooked how you want them, then what you're going to do is you're going to add some flour. You already have flour already on the chicken livers that you rolled them in, but now you're going to add more and it's going to make its own gravy. Kind of like almost a bechamel basically. So you're going to 
turn it up a little. You're going to add the flour and then you're going to add some milk. And that's all going to make like its own gravy with the chicken livers. And all you need to probably do is add some pepper because uh, it looks like I put enough salt on it. So we're going to cook this. We're turning it up a little like to a medium and we're going to cook it and it'll make a gravy. So on this, you definitely want a salt and pepper to taste. Um, and so right now, this is the gravy, and so it's pretty much done. I could add a little more milk if I want more gravy. Okay, so this last step is 100% optional. I don't know where I got this, but on occasion, I'll add a little tiny bit, just a hint of nutmeg. It does something to it, I don't know what, but don't put a lot. If you want to, you just put a little bit. And these, this is, this is pretty much done. This is exactly what it makes. It makes the chicken livers in a white gravy. Okay, here's our chicken livers and gravy. And I also have stuffing that I made earlier that I poured gravy on. So I'm having everything together as a meal. Like I said, I usually serve it with rice, and I pour the chicken livers and gravy over rice, but today I have stuffing. Mm. Super good. The, um, the gravy is like a white country gravy, because you use milk with it. And the milk is what makes it a country white gravy. It's very, very delicious. And it's cheap and very convenient to make. And it's really nice during this time when things are so expensive to make something that doesn't cost a lot. So I think you'll enjoy this. I hope you give it a try. Thank you. Okay, here it is. There's chicken livers poured with the gravy and the gravy poured over the stuffing.